Years ago, the only mechanism for controlling engine coolant temperature was a thermostat containing a pellet of brass and wax that had to melt so coolant could travel between the engine and the radiator. Today, vehicles manage the coolant temperature and ultimately the temperature of the combustion chamber via electronically controlled thermostats, electric water pumps, and now active grill shutters. Active grill shutters, also known as radiator shutter assemblies or movable grill shutters, are part of a category called active aerodynamics. Ford, BMW, and other OEMs have been including active grill shutters on vehicles for the past five years or so. The system optimizes aerodynamics and coolant temperatures by using electronically controlled slats to control airflow through the grill, radiator, and engine compartment. Here's the thinking behind them. If air is required to cool the engine, the vents are opened. If no airflow is needed, the vents are shut, which contributes to significantly reduced aerodynamic drag, which can improve fuel efficiency. These systems keep the vanes closed as long as possible when starting from cold. This technology can reduce the amount of time required to get the coolant and oil up to temperature during a cold start. Depending on the ambient air temperature and vehicle speeds, the active shutters can reduce emissions and the time to reach closed loop operation. Mounted ahead of the radiator, active grill shutters have motorized horizontal vanes that can rotate to block airflow. The ECM can control the pitch of the vanes to control the air passing through the radiator. Let's talk about some failure points. Since the active grill shutters are in front of the radiator, they're vulnerable to front end collisions. Obstructions also can cause problems, as can improper calibration. Most systems will fully actuate the shutter through their full range of motion when the vehicle started. External position sensors or position sensors mounted in the motors will track the movement. If there's an obstruction, damage, or problems with the motors, the system will fully open the shutters and set a code that will turn on the check engine light. Some manufacturers will open the shutters fully when the car is turned off, so if the shutter fails during a startup, it won't cause an overheated situation. We've seen predictions that the overall market for automotive active aerodynamics could reach $1.1 billion by 2023. So this is certainly a technology you should keep your eye on. I'm Josh Cable. Thanks for watching.